Hello and welcome to the cottage. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> well, if you've been wondering where I've been for the last uh, eight days, um, I've been at the beach. <laughs> I had my uh, grandson and granddaughter staying with me and we have been at the beach. And I don't just mean one beach, I mean a whole lot of different beaches and it's been an absolutely wonderful time. We made lots of wonderful memories and I got a little bit of a tan and um, they've now gone home and um, today's the big you know clean up day I've been cleaning up around the cottage all day today <laughs> you know windexing off of all those little sticky handprints off of everything but anyway um I have a beautiful uh reborn toddler for adoption and um I'm gonna you know explain the situation and then um, and then I'm going to show you some details of this gorgeous gorgeous girl so um, this little girl is Romy by Sandy Faber and she is approximately about a one one year old to 18 month old size baby she's 26 inches long but she is a major chunky monkey and I'll get into that with her details. Now the story with this little girl is I purchased her, um, I would say roughly about a year ago from the artist and her artist is Anna Lee May. Um, she has a store on eBay and I actually own have owned in the past more than one of her dolls because um, her painting is well you can just look at this little girl and see how exquisitely she's painted um, so I I purchased her from the artist um, I had her in my collection and then my mom took a liking to her and um, she went to live at my mom's where basically she just sat in a chair in her bedroom on display anyway to make a long story short, my mom has decided to take the plunge and get her first custom baby made. And she's a one reborn only lady and so I am looking for a new mommy or daddy or both for um, this gorgeous little Romy girl. So she she's approximately a year old, um, I mean don't quote me on that. Uh, she's in mint condition. I mean, she's been in my, you know, nursery. Um, and then she sat in a chair in my mom's room um, for, you know, I would say approximately six months or so. And uh, now I am putting her up for adoption. So um, I'm going to get into her details. Now, Annalie May, her artist, um, actually there's a few YouTubers that have her babies. I know uh, Carrie over at Ruby Red Reborns has one of her babies that she actually adopted from me. Um, I know Susie Q has one of her babies over at Susie Q's Happy Little Haven. Um, I think she's getting to be a fairly well-known artist. Um, her work is absolutely beautiful as you can see from this little girl. Um, so like I said, she is the Romy Sculpt by Sandy Faber, which is uh, no longer available on McPherson's, but I did notice it's available on um, Irresistibles um, still. So she, uh, she is a chunky monkey. <laughs> she is a big girl. Um, she's 26 inches long, but she's got a big head and she's got these really, really chunky, ch chunky arms. Anna Lee May paints my favorite kind of painting, my absolute favorite kind of painting. Um, you know, really peaches and cream painting. She does beautiful, beautiful, beautiful um, modeling and blushing. And I'm going to bring you closer so you can um, see her toenails and, and, and that kind of thing. But um, she has human hair, uh, strawberry blonde human hair um, that's, you know, beautifully rooted. Um, 
she has Ico dark brown glass eyes, uh, Ico polyglass eyes um, in dark brown. She has applied lashes. Um, she's got beautiful, I mean, just she's just a gorgeous, she's just a gorgeous baby. I mean, she really, truly is a gorgeous baby. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab the tripod and bring you in closer so you can get a look at this girl. <laughs> I love this sculpt. Um, I absolutely love this sculpt. I mean, she is so sweet. Um, she does take a pacifier. Um, she has full arms, so, you know, she can wear a cute little, like this little me outfit she's wearing. She can wear, but she does have three quarter legs. Um, and, uh, but, you know, I mean, that's not really a big deal because, uh, it's, it's nice when they have full arms versus, um, full legs because you can, you know, put them in little, little outfits like this with little flutter sleeves. Um, she's got big, <laughs> chunky monkey thighs. Like, look at these legs. Oh my gosh. Now she is very heavily weighted. Um, her limbs are, I would say, three quarters full of glass beads. She has a beautiful uh, doe suede body. Um, and like I said, she is very heavily weighted. She's a big girl. Um, her toenails are just done so realistically. So, so realistically. I'm just really hoping this is going to focus. 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 Look at her bottoms of her feet. How beautifully they're done. They're so, so realistic, you guys. For some reason, she's looking a bit shiny on the camera. She's not the least bit shiny. She has a gorgeous, um, very velvety, soft um, matting. I don't know what Anna Lee uses. Um, you could certainly contact her. She's, you know, she's got a store on eBay and ask her if you were interested. But, um, I mean, this face. Look at this face and her mouth. Look at this girl. Is she not absolutely gorgeous? Just so sweet. I just, you know, if I hadn't gifted her to my mom and my mom making the decision to get her first custom, um, I would be keeping her, of course. But, you know, sh my mom's going to put the money from her towards her first custom baby. And she's already chosen a sculpt and an artist and... Um, so uh, the money that I get for um, for this beautiful girl, look at these hands, look at these hands. She's got chunky, chunky hands. <laughs> chunky, chunky hands. Her hair is a lovely color. It is human hair. It's not super duper soft. It's, 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 uh, it's not as soft as mohair. Um, but she does have lots of it, lots and lots of it. Um, you know, it's, 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 it's more coarse in my opinion than mohair. Um, I know it is her granddaughter's hair. Um, when I purchased her, she told me that it was her granddaughter's hair and, um, which was kind of cool. And it's just a beautiful, beautiful color. I mean, it's, an, it's natural human hair. And she does have lots and lots of it. So she will be coming home. Um, she will be coming home in this adorable little me um, dress. And there's like a little polka dot diaper cover. And with this beautiful blanket. This brand new beautiful pale blue blanket. And her, of course her headband goes with her outfit. And uh, pa her pacifier. And her lovey her little bunny lovey because I like babies to leave the cottage with a bunny and here's the thing you guys and I, I you know to me this is not a big deal at all but I know for some people it is just given the you know the 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 uh climate right now in the reborn community with the replicas I mean she's 100% an authentic kit um 
you know, she has Sandy Faber's name on the back of her neck. But when I purchased this baby and, and she arrived home, I, I can't even believe I did this, but her paperwork was in the bottom of the box and I have no idea what was going on at that time. Um, but I took the box to the dump, um, with her paperwork in the bottom of the box. So she had a COA and she had, I think she had a little, uh, certificate from, um, Anna Lee May's, um, nursery and yeah. I mean, it's the, it wrote that I really did that. You guys, I really did that, but you know what? I really wasn't too worried about it because, because I just, you know, had no intention of rehoming her. I did do a box opening, but that was on my old channel, the bunny cottage. And I've since deleted that channel and all the videos with it. But, um, you know, if you have any concerns, you can certainly contact her artist and um, with a picture of her and just verify that she did create this beautiful girl um, from an original kit. Uh, you know, Anna Lee May has, um, you know, incredible reviews on eBay because she is an amazing, amazing artist. Actually, now that I think of it, uh, Carrie from Ruby Red Reborns has two of her babies. She has the Sage... Um, she has the Sage kit and she also has the Duane kit. So, um, yeah, anyway, um, her work is amazing. Um, you know, I continuously look at the new babies that she's puts out, but, um, and think that I want to purchase one because <laughs> her work is so beautiful. You know, this is just my kind of painting. You know, I, I I like this, I call it English rose painting. Some people call it peaches and cream. I call it English rose because it's just so subtle. Her eyebrows are done like amazing. So, so real. Look at this face, you guys. Look at that face. Yeah, she's just, she's stunning. She really is. Anyway, I will leave my email down below. Um, Oh, I completely forgot. Because I um, made that huge blunder and sent her box and her paperwork off to the dump, you know, over a year ago now, um, I'm only asking $450 for her, which is totally insane because I paid way more than that for her. I mean, she is a toddler and she is beautifully, beautifully done. But I understand that, you know, that is an issue for some people uh, to not have the paperwork. So, um, you know, my mom's wanting to get, you know, going on her, her custom baby. And um, so, you know, to get the funds into PayPal so I can order her kit and send it off to the artists, yada, yada, yada. I'm asking a ridiculously small amount for this baby. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Um, if you're interested in giving uh, Romy a home, please um, contact me. Uh, my email will be down below. And as always, take care.